Okay. So this pulse will be done with the machine. I'm going to switch to the 16 rod too. Yeah. All right, you a tick welder from from way back. Way back. From way back. Yeah. Stay on. He can flex a poor welder. Drop a car lock. What's that? He can flex a poor welder. All right, you know how gas pedal is, all right? I figured. You just step on it. It goes fast, and when you let off, it goes slow, right? Same thing with TIG welding. When you step on it, you get more current. When you let off, you get less current. Current is what melts the material and gives you your penetration. So you can see through that hood right now, right? Right-handed? Left-handed. Left. Good man. Left-handers always make better welders. It's just because I'm left-handed. So what we're going to do is you're going to bring that torch over, and like Brian was saying, you're going to hold it about an eighth of an inch off that work. I'm going to tell you to mash that pedal down, and we're going to watch the arc light. Then I'll tell you to let off, and then you just leave the torch right where it is, and we'll put a little tack on that, okay? All right? Are you ready? All right, mash. Mash it all the way down. You watch for that metal to turn liquid. You got it all the way down. There you go. Okay, let off. All right? And look there. See, we've, we've, made, a, we've made a little tack weld on that. All right, let's tack weld the other side. You're ready. We'll take that pulse off on you. All right, that's good. Beautiful. All right, now when we're going to weld that seam, you're going to go from left to right, right across in front of you as you're going. You want to just melt it together? Or do you want to put filler with it? Um, just melt it together. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going, your eyes have got to tell you when you see that puddle form, and then you just want to bring it down that joint and keep it the same width by your travel speed. All right. Get it right over top of it again. There you go. Arc on. That's it. Now just ease your way down the material. Stay right over the crack. Come on down. Come on to me. Just keep on moving. You're making a beautiful TIG, what we call a fusion weld, because there's no filler material being added. A lot of people will do that on outside corner welds. Very nice. How about that? Awesome. How about that? Way we to go, Zeke. We can definitely uh, get you work in the welding industry. There you go.